Hey everybody, we are back here with our next family and elsewhere. Uh oh, hold on. I gotta get little Xavier off to school. He was going and then something stopped him. I'm gonna need to change his clothes too. He's got on summer clothes. Uh, Ben's outfit's good. Um, Jimmy's might need changed. Um, I've redone their house a bit. I, um, I kind of used their, they had a really kind of a large back porch here, but they really needed more room inside the house with them having two children. And, uh, she actually has a want for another child. Um, and she's fortune sim. So, um, that's kind of interesting, but she does. So, um, I'm not going to, because they have two children, I'm going to follow my population control and I'm not going to have them try for baby. I'm not going to have them try for baby, but they can do it autonomously. Um, this is their, uh, we saw him age up last time, Barry. And this is Barry and Xavier's room. I thought this paint was more blue, but it's, it's looking purple to me now, but it's cute. They just, I gotta fix this chair. It's not supposed to, I originally had the beds flip-flopped and then, cause I don't use toddler beds very often. And I didn't realize that that needed flip the flop. And actually, I also need to get the toddler bedding. Is it this one? No. This is the Warsum bedroom set. Does it tell me where it's from? Thimble Sims. Okay, this is the toddler bedding. There we go. Uh, so, that's their cute little room. Moved the kitchen back here and moved the master up there. And, um, I can also give them a, a TV back. I think they previously had to put their TV up because we had the bed, the crib in the living room. This house was so small. I was going to consider having them move, but they actually didn't have enough money. They, um, the lot is now worth 16133 They have 1400 in the bank and they have 1918 in cash um just about the least expensive house in elsewhere what are they going to do oh goodness just about the least expensive house is about 20 simoleons so by the time they sold this plus all their furniture they would not have anything left to furnish a new house so it wasn't it wasn't really doable i'll have them save up or they're just doing a casual um and maybe they will move i don't know but this house uh you know with the two children and probably they could squeeze in a third at least while the baby is while the baby would be a baby or an infant or a toddler it would be tight but I think they could do it because they could squeeze in a crib here or maybe somewhere in their room. I don't know. But we'll see. Um, so they both have owned businesses. She is the, uh, she needs to quit her real job, actually. I mean, I gotta do that. Because she uh, she runs the clinic in town. She was in the medical career in Pleasant View and was asked to come here and run the clinic and elsewhere. He was an architecture... Arch, architect? What am I saying? He was an architect in Pleasant View and he was asked to come here to run the architect office. 
and so he he owns that building um so we could take them down to either of their businesses today you know what i think i'll take her down first because if she's wanting to have another baby um you know i don't know i don't know if they're gonna be doing the try for baby she doesn't want to get a pet but since she doesn't specify which one right now i'm not gonna have them go down to the animal shelter uh, i think i did specify this and i don't remember if it was elsewhere or beckett ridge but when i'm playing the animal shelter and i find a sim that's like walking by or coming in and they want to obtain a pet i'm gonna let them adopt a pet but when I'm playing the individual uh, Sims houses, I want them to tell me what they want. Alright, let's go ahead and have Demi go down to the clinic. Oops. Oh, wow. Vlard new paid. Sablo. Oh my gosh, you guys. I did not notice they got a genie lamp. Yes. And of course, right after I got their house kind of together. Because you know, he coming over here and he wishing for some money. He wants to make a wish. Does she want to? Not yet. But she's not been to the lot, I don't think, since it's been here. So you come over here and you rub this lamp. Oh. 
I am an all-powerful genie with the fabric of the universe at my command. I will grant you three wishes. We are going to wish for give me wealth. Earn some money. Okay, let's see how much they get. Whoa, ten thousand simoleons. All right. We got to put Genie away until they roll another uh, want to make a wish. Okay, so I'm also going to have him come over here and deposit that money. Oops. So that they can make some money on their money. All right. Now I'm hoping either he gets another want to roll the to uh, make a wish or Demi does when she gets home. She's wanting to go out on a date. Ben, really? You're a fortune, Sam. Why are you playing in the tub? All right, so today um, Xavier is off to school, and I think I'm going to send um, Ben down to the, whoops, no, 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 not do yoga. I'm going to send him down to his architecture building, architectural designs. Okay, so what should we do today of elsewhere? Um, how about the lighthouse? I'm not sure. We might have one of the lighthouse. Okay. Oh shoot, is he open? I think I'm gonna close it until he gets some drafted. He doesn't have anything right now to sell. He completely sold out. Sorry about that, thank you. Okay, so he has it complete. Take it here, hang it on the wall, and we will frame it. What's the matter with you? I'm going to have you draft one more. Mm. Like of the bridge. Maybe he had to, he designed that for elsewhere. We could say. Maybe from this view. I like having that. Uh, hill showing you in my my imagination the view to elsewhere or not to elsewhere to um, get back to pleasant view the thing about these drafts is it does seem to take them a pretty long time to draft them he actually just maxed out his um, 
creativity. But it takes him a while to get these drafted. So that's why I think he'll just do the drafts today. And then we'll come back a different day and actually sell. Because they are awesome on simoleons. They got that lamp. And I'm hoping one of them rolls the want to, to rub the lamp again. All right, he's got the other one up. Let's go ahead and frame that one. And then we will set these for sale. Wow, look at those prices. That is amazing. Okay, so let's go ahead and send him home. I'm going to have her make some smart milk for Barry. Let's see if we can get him um, learning some of his toddler skills. And he does need to use the potty here soon. So, And she, I, yeah, she's in platinum. So the smart milk should work perfect. Oh, Barry. Come here, Barry. Oh, Ablo. Um, there's a room. No, no, no. Drink your bottle first. All right, let's see if she can get him to the potty. Wow, so close. Oh, he got it. He got it. Yay. All right, now let's teach him to walk. Oh, he wants to rub the lamp. What is he mad at? All right, well, I got a roll for Jay Broke. He stole a newspaper. Nope, he got away. Put Barry in the crib. Oh, Xavier's home. You're sleepy. Okay, go take a nap and then... Why is she not putting him in there? Here, you come use the bathroom. He can get in there himself. Maybe. Oh my goodness. Okay, there we go. All right, <clears throat> so Xavier will have his birthday tomorrow. Uh-oh, they're out of groceries. Oh, no. All right, get some leftovers out. So we have two days until Barry's birthday and one day until Xavier's. My plan is to impress Jean Ray of Atlanta, Georgia. 
penas ploku taki citni. Oh, tik skengi tu. Nāks atsūti tik citni. Tik vēsā pusi. Au, marhār. Xavier is wanting to play with a relative and he needs fun really bad. So I'm going to have his play with red hands with his mom. And since Xavier wants to rub the lamp, I'm going to have send him out here to do that. You come here and play with Ben. He's wanting to be played with by you. Not Ben, Barry. Be tickled. Hmm, so he can't wish for money. How about give me a long life? I hope that doesn't mess up his age. <laughs> Oh no, it did. Okay, so what I decided to do, I'm still going to age him up tomorrow. Um, and then when he becomes an adult, I am going to remember to add five days to him. So this is Xavier. Add five, wait, is it five days or three? Add three days. Oh no, another burglar, and I don't think they have an alarm. No. Oh no. Wake up, where's the phone? Where's the phone? Stan, wake up. Jessica Ebody again. Oh, she stole their car. Okay, well, she got away, but I'm still rolling to see if she eventually gets caught and has to go to court. So let's roll. Nope, she got away. See, I see she's up to her old schemes. Wow. Actually, before you go back to bed, go ahead and pay the bills. I'm also buying them a burglar alarm. Okay, so it's Saturday morning, and I'm going to have the family go down to the playground and play for a little bit before throwing uh, Xavier's birthday party. Okay, well, shoot, I thought I had a sim blender here so that I could teleport Barry over so he could play too, but apparently I don't. 
so it's just going to be Xavier that gets to play a little bit on the playground, but that's okay. I need to remember to come back here and put a sim blender. There's Mallory. Demi's grilling up some hot dogs. Oh gosh, it's snowing. All right, well, I think Demi and Ben are going to have some afternoon delight. <laughs> Casual. All right, not a try for baby. Look at all these toys out, Xavier. Oh, he's cleaning up. That's a good boy. Okay, well, the birthday party, she isn't going to be able to throw because it's because I messed up his aging dag blame it. But we're going to go ahead and have her throw a party. Okay, so I threw a party. We And I also teleported some over, over some of the elsewhere teens. Edward, Netherland, Vera, and Mark. And then um, we got Alexander and Tierra Goth out here. They are uh, Ben's dad and sister. And then we also invited the grandmas, Kaylin, Lothario, and Tasha Goss. And um, since we're not really going to be able to use the cake, um, which I totally forgot before I sent Ben off to get the cake, uh, we, I'm just going to age him up with the Some blender. Okay, um, I want you to come over here and talk to some of these teens. Actually, let's just go ahead and age them up. Well, yeah, let's just age them up. Um, age to teen, Xavier Goth. All right, you come here and talk to your little teen neighbors. He was a Libra. I have that written down. So that will make him, oh, romance. Ooh. And his turns, turn ons are formal and logical, turn leaf is muscular. I want him to chat with everybody. Let's take a good look at him. He's so cute. He looks like his mom. Look, you can kind of see he's got like her face. Look at that. Yeah, he looks like her. Except with red hair. All right, Ben is home. Hank's <laughs> coming home in his underwear. That's nice. They're stuck over here. Look at Kate, Tasha Goth. I was going to say Caitlin, it's Tasha. 
Um, Holden Berry, how sweet. Um, Xavier's clothes look, or is that his out? I think that's his, um, winter. All right, the party was a roof raiser. Everybody out. Too many sims. Okay, we are back at Ben's studio. He brought Xavier with him. So, um, he's going to work with his dad today. Let's go ahead and open, and we will have him draft again and we will have Xavier run the cash register the lighting is terrible in here okay we need to pick another I said I was gonna do the fire station Okay, so we'll have Ben draft that up. And are we open? I think so, yes. Okay, can you come help her? all right we are rank one um let's go ahead and get those simoleons How did I know he was going to do a sponge bath? Check in on Ben's drawing, or blueprint, I should say. What is also interesting to note about Xavier is that his hobby is arts and crafts. So, um, that's good. He may choose to do something like his dad. Let's put this over here. Let's frame this and let's mark it for sale. Wow, 713 simoleons. And I'm going to have Ben do one more. Okay, can we tell her to leave? And come in here and do cells to her. Get out of here, jump roping. Hmm. 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 Hmm.
Okay, we're going to go ahead and close for the day. They made good money today. Oh, so she bought it. Wow, they sold out again. Look, look at their cash flow. That's really good. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and have them go home first. They are going to go to the grocery store because there's no groceries at home. Alright, so here they are at the grocery store. Let's go ahead and purchase. All right, Ben is home. He's got the groceries with him. Um, Demi, not Demi, is that her name? Yeah, Demi invited over Tiara, who's Ben's sister. Oh my gosh, I totally just missed little Barry's birthday. <laughs> Poor Barry. I'm sorry, Barry, but grab a plate of Grandma's comfort soup. Let me look at ya. We're gonna change them clothes. I'm not a fan of that shirt. <laughs> You can keep the pants. I don't know what's on the back of that shirt. They got two little redhead boys. I mean, I suppose the shirt's not terrible. I just don't really know what's on the back of it. Let me take a look. See if I can figure it out. It's the horse riding shirt or something. Equestrian. I'm going to go ahead and switch out his bed. I'll just get him the same bed as his. All right, I just switched him out for this little hoodie here. Okay, well, it has changed over to spring. So we are done here with the goths round. And the next family, we will be moving on to who are the Liverpools. We are back to our fishermen family. So I hope you all enjoyed and I will see you next time. Thank you for watching. Bye.